give you praise. We appreciate you from that time. You are the Lord. That is your name. You will never share your glory with any man. We give you praise. We exalt your name. For you are God. For in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. We give you praise. God has been awesome. Yes, it is. A new week and uh, a first full week in this year. We thank God for His grace. Thank you for joining us again on a daily journey. Today we are reading from Ephesians chapter 5 from verse 1 to 2. Ephesians chapter 5 verse 1 and verse 2. We are reading the message translation and we are talking about love like that. Love like that. And he said, watch what God does and then you do it. Like children who learn proper behavior from their parents. Mostly what God does is love you. He said, keep company with him and learn a life of love. Observe how Christ love, loved us. His love for was not cautious but extravagant. He did not love in order to get something from us, but to give everything of himself. Hallelujah. Exciting scripture. And it, it tells so much about how God has loved us and how he also encourages and recommends to us that we show that same love to others. Now, why is this very important? Because you see, to walk in love as Christ has loved us is, is the scripture calls it a sweet smelling savour, is a sacrifice to God, an offering and a sacrifice to God. Praise the Lord. See, beloved, the Christian work that we are called to is one that has responsibilities, responsibilities that God calls of us. He calls us imitators of God said be imitators of god as beloved children see this is a strong and clear ring and call from god that we should imitate christ we should imitate god the principle of imitation of god is one that jesus took from the old testament you know what the lord said to moses he said say to israel you shall be holy for i the lord your god i am holy if you check in leviticus chapter 19 and verse 2 now jesus is saying unto us also like he said in matthew 5 verse 48 he said you therefore must be perfect as your heavenly father is perfect so the call to perfectness of love the call to love it, it, it did not start today. If you go to Luke chapter 6, verse 36, Luke chapter 6, verse 36, scripture says, Be merciful as your Father is merciful. So you see, the attributes of God are the things He has called us to display out there in the world. He said, God made us in His image and likeness. So our being called, our call to be like Him is a call to God's nature and action that is already in us. So when he calls us to love, he calls us to forgive. Therefore, forgiving one another, even as God in Christ forgave us. He tells us to walk in love. See, these images of us as children of God are critical for the world, little wonder scripture said in Romans chapter 8 that the earnest expectation of all creatures awaited the world manifestation of the sons of God. Our world is where it is today because we have not taken up the mantle, the mandate to love just like God has loved. So, what do you go through today? Why do you have a lot that you are struggling with? Why is it difficult to forgive? Why is it difficult to love? Is there a connection in all of this with the style of life or quality of life that is happening in our society today? Yes, the sum total of our individual actions, little by little, adds up to the eight and the kind of world we have today. But we can make a difference and you can make a difference. I can make a difference. Can we change that in 2021? Can we be imitators of God? Can we watch what God does and then do it? Can we do that? Can we love like that? It's not easy to do that, but with God, 
we can do all things. Reconcile your relationship with Him so that He can teach you by His Spirit all things. Praise God. So call the numbers on the screen. I will be there to pray with you and to walk with you so that together we can hack into the call of Jesus who stands at the door of our heart knocking. God bless you and do have a wonderful week. Amen. Hallelujah.